Hi, today let's learn how to convert from mixed number into improper fraction. Here we go. Let's read this fraction. 1 and 3 forces. This is a mixed number. Consists of whole number and the fraction. Now, we need to convert this mixed number into improper fraction. At first, we have a model that represents this fraction. Here we have 1 and 3 forces. Now, we need to convert this mixed number into improper. At first, look at the denominator. It will be the same because the denominator represents how many broken parts in one shape. So, the denominator will be the same. I will write 4 in the denominator at first. Now, how to get the numerator? What should we do? To get the numerator, we need to know how many equal parts do we have in this fraction. So, this whole number, you will multiply it by the denominator. Let's multiply it. You will multiply 1 by 4. So, we will break this one into four parts, as we see. Now, we have 1 by 4. Then, we will add the number of parts that we have in the fraction. So, we will write 1 by 4 plus 3. As you see, like this. We multiply the whole number by the denominator to get the number of broken parts in one shape. Then you will add the number of parts that you have in this fraction. You will add the numerator. Four parts in one whole and then three parts in this fraction. Now, let's get the result. In the numerator, we have 1 by 4 equal 4 plus 3 equal 7. So, the answer is 7 fourths. And this is the improper fraction. Let's practice more. Here we go. What should we do to convert this mixed number into improper fraction? At first, let's look at this model. Here we have three whole numbers, three full colored shapes, and one half. So, it's 3 and half. Now, let's convert this mixed number into improper fraction. The first step, you will write the same denominator. Here we have the denominator is 2. So, you will write in the denominator just 2. Now, I need to get the numerator. What should I do? At first, you will multiply the whole number by the denominator. To get the number of parts that you have, like this, 3 by 2, it means you will break each full colored shape into two parts, like this. Now, you will add all of these parts, 3 by 2 plus 1 part. Let's add them. 3 by 2, 6, plus 1, equal 7, 7 halves. This is the improper fraction. Let's write it. We have here 7 halves, as you see. Now, can you convert this mixed number into improper fraction without a model? Here we go. Let's read it at first. Here we have 4 and 2 fifths. Can you answer this? At first, let's write the denominator. It will be just 5, as you know. Then, how to get the numerator? Do you remember? We will multiply the whole number by the denominator. It will be 4 by 5. It will be 20. Then you will add the numerator in the fraction plus 2. So, it will be 20 plus 2. Now, can you write the answer? Yes, 
it will be 22 fifths, 22 over 5 or 22 fifths. Now, let's practice more. Here we go. We will convert this mixed number into improper fraction. Can you answer this? At first, let's read it. 3 and 4 sevenths. Help me to answer this. Okay. At first, we will write the same denominator. It will be 7, as you know. Now, how to get the numerator? At first, let's multiply the whole number by the denominator. 3 by 7 equal 21. Then you will add plus 4 plus the numerator equal 21 plus 4. Now, do you know the answer? I think it's so easy. It will be 21 plus 4 equal 25 sevenths or 25 over 7. And this was our lesson. Thank you.